Hey guys, this is the Magicos 14 cup food processor and I want to thank Magicos for sending me this. This is an awesome food processor. I was really impressed by it. You can see there's several different blades that you can switch out to cut fries, finely grate, two different size of slicing blades, and then in the blade holder I already have um, your typical size shredding blade because I'm going to shred some carrots um, for you. You've got your blade um, that sits inside the bowl and then that piece right there will fit onto your center. Um, that's the blade holder and you can see I've got the shredder in there. And then the center piece, the blade, that sort of non-sharp black blade will do dough. So you can even do dough in here um, and it will help spin your dough around. Um, the lid has a really interesting feeder so you can feed small things um, with your pusher and then you can also lift the lid up. The whole thing will come out. Um, so you can use both sides to press down whatever it is that you're processing. But then the whole lid opens. So that feeder opening opens and you'll see I was able to fit a whole tomato in there and I didn't have to cut it. And so that way I got slices of the whole tomato. And once you have your bowl and everything fit, the lights will flash. You can see it's quickly shredding the carrots. So it worked really quickly. It was very easy to use. And you'll see it got um, the shredder, the blade um, holder has those two holes. So you can safely lift it out of the bowl. So there's my shredded carrots, um, chopped up an onion in no time. It's got three different buttons there. It's got multiple speeds. So the onion was seconds that it chopped that up. So you can see nice, finely chopped. And then I'm going to switch this out and we're going to try slicing up a tomato. I was really curious about how that would work. So you can just see I'm fitting that all together. I've got the blade holder on top there and then watch it slice this tomato. I hit the slice button turn the speed on and then it just is super thinly slicing the tomato. So if you wanted um, very thinly sliced tomato for sandwiches or anything like that, it worked really well. So see how thin those are. So I was really excited by that. Then um, last thing, I'm gonna do a sweet potato and I put the fry um, blade on there. So we're gonna see how this works. And again, just um, I turned up the speed once I had it all fit together and it it was really interesting. You'll see what the fries look like. I thought it did a really great job. So there you go. Really worked great.